Welcome to the WebTutor Course Cartridge Blackboard Installation for eBook and SCORM Content installment of the CourseCare Self-Training Video Series for Instructors. This training video will walk you through the process of importing the course cartridge into Blackboard 9, downloading the course package, setting up the gradebook, accessing your course package and instructor tools, and contacting technical support. To begin, sign into your Blackboard account. Next, click on the course name where you will install the course cartridge. Choose Packages and Utilities from the control panel on the left side of the page. Next, click on Import Course Cartridge. If you do not see an option for Import Course Cartridge, check with your Blackboard administrator as this may be disabled in your account login. Finally, enter the 12-digit Course Cartridge key that was provided by Cengage Learning. The request will be placed into a queue and you will receive an email notifying you that the cartridge was imported successfully. Note that this process can take 2 to 24 hours depending on the activity on your Blackboard server. You will want to wait until you receive the confirmation email before you proceed with step 2. The second step is to download your course package. To begin, open the email you received from Cengage Learning and click the Download Course Package link and save the zip file to your desktop. Next, download the Quick Start Guide, which provides you with step-by-step -step instructions on how to import your course package. Please save these instructions and print them out for easy reference. Also, write down your instructor access code, which will enable you to access your course resources. We will refer to this later. Log into Blackboard and enter your course from the My Courses panel. Next, click Customization and then click Tool Availability. Verify if the checkbox for SCORM content is selected and click Submit. With Edit Mode turned on, click on the Course Documents area in the Course menu at the top left. If you do not see a Course Documents area, your course cartridge load from Step 1 may not have fully completed. For Blackboard 9.0, select Add SCORM Content from the Build tab. For Blackboard 9.1, select Content Package SCORM from the Build Content tab. In the Title Text field, enter a title for the link to your course package. Next to the File Zip Select, click Browse and select the zip file that you downloaded to your desktop. Please note, it is recommended that you use the following SCORM content options. Navigation control type, choice. Add gradebook item, yes. Track attempt details, yes. First attempt only, no. Make content visible, yes. Track number of views, no. Skip the Choose Date Restrictions selection by leaving the display after and display until checkboxes unchecked. Click Submit. Your course package should now be available from the Course Documents area. On the Manage SCORM Gradebook Items page, click the 
Add Grade Center column button next to the SCORM lessons that were listed as gradable in your course delivery email. It is recommended to use the default Grade Center column name to ensure proper grade synchronization. Enter the points possible for each selected item. Now that you have added the course package to your course and set up the gradebook, you can launch the content player and view your course package. To launch the content player, click on the course package link that was created when you added the zip file to your course. On the left menu, you will see the resources included in your course package. Scroll through the left menu of the content player to find the Instructor Tools link under Course Package Tools. Click on the Instructor Tools link and enter the Instructor Access Code that was provided to you in your Course Package email. When you launch any of these resources for the first time, a brief System Check Utility will run. If your system is incompatible, the System Check Utility will provide you with the necessary information and resource links to help you properly configure your system. You can now access instructor tools including course gradebook details from here. You can also request a new course package or additional instructor access codes from this window. You may click on any of these resource or assignment links to open them in the content player window. Pop-up blocking must be disabled and cookies enabled in order to view the content. If you continue to encounter any issues when attempting to view content, you can contact Technical Support. To contact Technical Support, scroll through the left menu of the content player to find the Technical Support link under Support and Documentation. Click on the link and the Technical Support request form will open. To contact our technical support staff, fill out the form completely and click Send. To access the Student Quick Start Guide, scroll through the left menu of the content player to find the Student Quick Start Guide under Support and Documentation. Click on the link to open the Student Quick Start Guide in a new window. You can print or save this guide if you would like to provide it to your students. Thank you for taking the time to review this self-training video. Additional support information can be found at the support page cengage.com forward slash support.